Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another tutorial. Today I will be showing how to show or hide specific Windows updates. Now as most of you guys are aware, if you're looking up this video, you will find pretty quickly after using Windows 10 for a little bit that you cannot custom install updates, meaning you really can't go through and select which updates you want to install, and all the updates are pretty much bundled together as one update and there really is no option to enable or disable this even though I did make a video tutorial of how to disable updates altogether but there's really no clear way in the main Windows update page on how to select custom updates so fortunately Microsoft released a tool that will allow users of Windows 10 to select custom updates to install and it will also allow users the ability to hide updates and install at a later time very similar to Windows 8 and earlier editions of Windows. So I already have the tool on the computer here on the desktop. I will have a link to this in the description of this video. I'm going to double click on this tool. Now it will say show or hide updates. And basically this is a troubleshooting tool made by Microsoft. If you cannot open it up after double clicking on the tool itself, there's another workaround for that. You can also open this up by right clicking on the tool and select open with and then diagnostic troubleshooting wizard and then click OK. So fortunately on this computer that's not an issue so double clicking on this works and we can see that we have the ability to click on next. And this may take a moment, generally this is going to be searching for some updates, take a couple of seconds, but we are at this point that now we can either hide Windows updates or show hidden updates that we've already hidden in the past. Since we do not have any hidden updates already, we can select hide updates. So now we have a list of updates that Microsoft would have normally automatically installed with the next round of Windows updates. However, as we can see now, we actually have the ability to hide specific updates. So for the sake of this review, I'm going to hide two updates here. I'm going to hide the soft removal tool, very common tool, and um, definition update for Windows Defender. Let's say we're using a VAST or another antivirus and we don't want to download updates for Windows Defender. So we can click on Next. It will say it's resolving the problem. Again, this may take a couple moments here and then it'll say the problems found which were basically the two updates that we just hid we see that the problems were fixed quote unquote meaning that the updates were hidden and we see a little check mark next to them so now if we close out of the troubleshooter and we want to go back into our troubleshooting tool we can click on next again now if you want to restore any updates that we already hid in the past. Now let's say you hit an update a couple weeks ago and you want to now install it after hearing that there weren't any bugs or errors associated with any one particular update. Now you can go under show hidden updates. You can select any hidden updates. You can see both of the updates that we hit before are listed in here. We can select next and by doing this it will restore them back into the list of updates to be installed and virtually this is a supplemental tool to help get back what you had in Windows 7 and Windows 8 by restoring what I believe to be a very important feature. So I hope this video tutorial helped you out guys and I will see you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.